role in the UFO Festival every year is to be here as a place for people to come in and kind of re-energize. And that includes getting um, cold drinks, hot drinks, caffeine, food, and have a cold place to sit uh, for a little while that's just not, not crazy and noisy. We love UFO Festival as a coffee shop. We think of it as Halloween in July. Um, it brings in people from all over the world. 25,000 people descend on the city all at once, and we are just so jazzed for it. So we staff up. Um, we, we try to be here so we can take care of the endless lines, you know, make sure that we cycle people through, and also have a comfortable place for people to sit and just relax for a little while. And then also, you know, we try to have pop-up music um, in the, during the day. This year I'm trying to get the symphony to have a trio maybe playing throughout the UFO Festival so you can relax and enjoy some cool music. And then if we're allowed to have gatherings like of groups again, we'll open up the back garage door and maybe have some heavy metal bands in the evening. We'll stay open a little later. Um, but other than just being here and just loving all of it, and we'll have specials too. We'll have our alien specials, of course. Um, but we'll be here for, for the throngs of people to, to, to re-energize.